టీవీ ప్రేక్షకులకు నమస్కారం శ్రావణ మాసంలో అమ్మవారికి నచ్చే మెచ్చి నైవేద్య వంటకాలు మీకు వచ్చా అయితే పసుపు కుంకుమ చీర సారలతో మేమే మీ ఇంటికి వచ్చి మీరు చేసే వంటకాలను అందరికీ పరిచయం చేస్తుంది ఈ కార్యక్రమం మీరు చేయవలసిందల్లా మీ పేరు అడ్రస్ అలాగే వంటకం మా వాట్సాప్ నంబర్కి సెండ్ చేయండి మా వాట్సాప్ నంబర్ సెవెన్ డబల్ త్రీ సెవెన్ డబల్ ఫైవ్ ఫోర్ ట్రిపుల్ సిక్స్ ఇంకెందుకు ఆలస్యం వెంటనే కింద స్క్రోల్ అవుతున్న మా వాట్సాప్ నంబర్కి మీ అడ్రస్ ని సెండ్ చేయండి థ్యాంక్ యూ హలో ఐఎమ్ వైష్ణవి అండ్ వెల్కమ్ టు దీస్ ఆఫ్ అండర్స్టాండింగ్ ఆర్కేక్ హ్యూమన్ ఎవల్యూషన్ హౌ లాంగ్వేజ్ ఒరిజినేటెడ్ ద లింగ్విస్టిక్స్ the development of different languages and much more we are going to learn in this class but before learning about language origin let us understand the human commencement in the throughout the journey so the first episode is the human evolution how did the human race begin and the spread into the world first tracing down from the chimpanzees before that humans have evolved from the chimpanzees root which comes from the apes so before us becoming humans the modern humans the homo erectus uh, have started this was tra- this can be traced down from 2 millions of years ago the hu- uh, the homo erectus originated from africa around 2 million years ago and spread out to different parts of the places so our whole ancestral population began began from central part of africa where the human races are related to be in the present generation the birth of homo sapiens is traced down to be the to be around 200000 years ago and 60000 years ago they spread they started to spread and migrate from africa the uh, populating middle east to the central asian and nearly 40000 european present countries as the neanderthals group the tribe with the, uh, spread with the waves of uh, of cultural exchange in the process and the uh, and, and they fell into extinct so with a lot of race progress and the cultural exposure and different environmental exposures the wave has spread into america nearly 15000 years ago and so on reached the south american tip as the end of their journey and that's how the the greatest walk of our tribe have traveled from africa till the south american trip during the travel there were there was a huge amount of change that has incorporated with the environment the evolvement of themselves within and between the tribes the major way of communication was only through the gestures and actions in the beginning and then a need to survive became the necessity by which the revolution of hunting communicating mating farming started nearly 12000 years ago and then agriculture represented as a mark of massive shift in the human activity and on the other hand adapting the environmental resources that were available for their needs which was continued roughly to 5 to 10000 years ago building a group of huts which which was formed as a village and settling or traveling and campaigning with the shift of cultural exchange and gather increased this is this this also led to a collective learning increase in diversification of labor of for the survival the progress of the civilization the birth of empires dynasties golden age tra- new inventions traveling became common and the population also increased during this period of time during the 6th century there was a outbreak of deaths due to bubonic plague as estimated to nearly to 25 million people have diseased late in 1480 european europeans ar- arrived america colonization and ruling slave trade industrial revolution started all over the world so how do you think that from where we have come our roots origin and the traditions that we have been followed accustomed from people through the changes over these period of time all this can be pinned not only from the manuscripts and dna tests to find out the results but the first evidence was from writing on the stone writing doesn't mean literally writing but rock carving where the communication was carved on the stones for them to remember as well as the visitors so that the the knowledge wouldn't be forgotten gradually writing started and the spread of knowledge served in papers and this lasted until the invention of the printing press in china and europe communication unfolded from the split of the tribe into different parts of the continents 
cultural exchange, gesture, shouting and body movements have made a difference. Rock carving to printing press, writing from the letters to the emails and now nearly 8 million people use the mobile phones. So what do you think the evolution has started, how it has changed, that is how the communication part began. I don't understand how simple it was for them and that's how the revolution has happened. So do you think the homo sapiens, the homo erectors or the neanderthals had faced easy issues in travelling or how hard was it for them to travel from one continent or from the birth or the spotted from different part and the other end of the continent to spread. And that's how the revolution happened from Homo erectus, from Homo sapiens and the Neanderthals spread in different parts and evolutionizing and colonizing different parts have made our, our generation or the modern human as the existing people. Hope you enjoyed and got the, new, the information that has always been there about the early men or the archaic human evolution. This is Vaishnavi signing out. Thank you. Please like, share and subscribe our channel.